I'm Andy and this is my wife Claire. If you're watching this video, you're probably like us and love spending time on campsites. Campsites offer a unique experience that you can't get from other types of accommodation, but we're starting to wonder, is it getting too expensive in the UK? In this episode, we visited Scarborough West Ayton Club Campsite, a caravan and motor home club site, five miles from the beautiful seaside town of Scarborough in North Yorkshire. Due to us being totally unorganised as usual, we had to book a premium pitch as it was the only space left. The pitch cost £58.50 for the night, but the Caravan and Motorhome Club site says that as a member we save £15 a night. That means that they believe a premium pitch at this site is worth £73.50 a night. Let's leave the £59 a year joining fee off the figures to make it simpler. The premium pitch comes with a barbecue area for disposable barbecues, its own tap for drinking water and wastewater drain, a picnic table and a privacy fence. Out of curiosity, I searched for a hotel room in Scarborough and found the Area West for £3.50 less at just £70 a night. This hotel room has a private bathroom with a shower, tea and coffee making facilities, its own bed, fresh linen, places to get away from Clare and it's only 200 yards from Scarborough Castle. It's fair to say that a hotel doesn't have the same views or ambience as a campsite, so to address that, here's a picture of our pitch at one of the most expensive countries in Europe, Camping Jungfrau, Switzerland. In case you're wondering, this cost us £50.76 a night, almost £8 less than the site five miles from Scarborough. Join us as we check out the campsite facilities and take a look at what you can do within walking distance from this site. Did we just get robbed? Hello. Hi. Where are we? We are in Scarborough. What's the name of the place? It's Scarborough West Ayton mm. Motorhome and Caravan Club. And we've just got set up. Before we get into our review of the campsite, let's take a walk into the local village of Ayton, Scarborough, which apparently has a couple of pubs. You can reach Ayton via a gently sloping road. It's got some tarmac footpaths and some grass footpaths. I could give you some history about Ayton, but to be honest, that kind of thing's really boring to me. So you'll have to do your own Google search. The first pub was called the Forge Valley Inn, and it had a secret beer garden, although there were other people in there too. The pub looks all right, but to be fair, it didn't matter. I'd have gone in whatever. What we got? I'm not fussy, really. My dream. Cheers. Cheers. At the old forge. So food's finished. So all you can get is peanuts and mini cheddars. Yeah. That's not good. Have we got any food for tonight? We've got barbecue food, but we've got no barbecue. Tell me about the journey. Yeah, so it were a band from America. They did uh, It's Like Don't Stop Believing. Oh, tell and me an interesting fact about that band. Mm. It's not like, actually that interesting when you've heard it hundred times, but tell yeah, me. Neither of you. What happened? No, I once, <laughs> I once, I once uh, <coughs> yeah. weed at the side of a, oh, a anyway. guitarist. <laughs> You're mm. the journey reliever. <laughs> <laughs> and then oh, I saw her stop. face. <laughs> I'm a journey reliever. <laughs> you got any interesting stories? No, I'm married to you. <laughs> We're on a premium pitch. And what is the premium pitch, Claire? What does that entail? Well, it has a barbecue. Yes. So let's have a look at the barbecue. Yeah, let's look at the barbecue. So this is the barbecue. Mmm. Um, I know I'm a bit dozy, but I'm not sure how you cook on that. There's no gas. No, I don't think you have What? Gas, I think you just put like a disposable barbecue on it. Maybe. Is that what you do? Well, that's not very really so. deceptive, isn't it? We're at the Stefan Denison Arms and we're drinking Heineken. It's Claire's round, we've been downgraded. There's nothing else. So that's okay, we'll go to that spa, which is quite a big spa. Yeah. Um, should we get a barbecue, like you said? Yeah, I think we should barbecue. We've got some really good quality burgers in, in Van. One thing to think, we've probably not got a lighter to light it. Yeah, we have. Have we? Yeah, we have, yeah. I don't know if it works, we'll just put one in. Okay, and then what else have we got? We have an outside picnic area. Oh yeah. And we'll have to wipe it down. Pablo's enjoying the picnic area. Pabas? 
Pablo. I love crisps. Pringles. I love all crisps, but um, I'm particularly attracted to Pringles and chipsticks. Salt you were saying though that salt and vinegar. I don't think Pringles are uh, quality controls off. It's bad. I don't know who's checking the quality on them, but they need to sort themselves out because you can buy a pack and it's re really vinegary. Mm. Awesome. Great. Love it. Could eat the whole pack in, literally mm. within the hour. Mm. Probably about half, half hour. Mm. But then you get the odd salt and vinegar pack. There's just no vinegar in them. So I'll eat them, obviously. But Are you buying knockoff ones? No, I, no. I have bought, I have bought knockoff ones, and sometimes knockoff ones are probably better. Privacy wall. Oh yeah, don't forget. We've, so we've paid extra for the privacy, privacy wall. wall. Yeah. Let's check the privacy wall out. Mm, not very private. We'll have to define privacy. Look that's in the, the privacy wall. That. So that's good because I can just sit back in my slacks. And that behind our plot is the main thoroughfare to Scarborough, so people keep walking past, so it's not private. Right then, so what we're cooking up tonight? These are burgers. Yeah. West Country burgers, cheddar oh yeah. burgers. Cheddar burgers. So we've got some fillet steak there, look, a couple yeah. of fillets each. We've got sausages. Sausages aren't on here yet. We've got four, four burgers. Yeah, get your crocs on. Yeah, baby. And socks. Hey, there's only two showers in our, our block. There's not a lot. You've got some uh, courtesy crocs. Got some what? Courtesy crocs. Yeah, there you've got your crocs out for you, baby. Oh, yeah, courtesy crocs. Oh, we've got a beautiful rose. What a spread. Mm. Hey, that looks tasty. <laughs> Yours looks even better. <laughs> what is that? Is it Aberdeen Angus? It's a fancy burger, but it's just squidged, it's just squidged a bit. Fancy Listen, burger. Listen, you've got your fillet coming now. Ooh, I can't wait. If the burgers are like that, imagine what the fillets are like. I think we might need another gas canister. It doesn't seem to be getting very hot. Just like Claire. That's much better. Is it? Yeah. You got a new canister on? Yep. Well, semi. What's it taste like? It's okay. What's that burger like? Oh my god. It's the best burger I've ever had. Is it They're fillet steaks then. Give over. They're not rumps. I don't want no rump. <laughs> Mum's getting cold. <laughs> She's closing up. You're trying to keep warm. I am. Are you warm? No. You're cold. It's cold tonight, isn't it? Yeah. Food that on was, the rocks. We did have a bowl, but we've lost it. It looks horrible, that. It loves it. it Do you know what it looks like? What? You know, like when you've got a bird, you get that cuttlefish. Mm, he loves this food. <laughs> Watch out for my trend setting. <laughs> We're watching. <laughs> if it gets any colder, I'm not sitting there, are you? Just eat inside, aren't we? Yeah. Yeah, it is. Nothing yeah. says premium like a. Artificial rose on a towel. <laughs> These are not the droids you're looking for. I'm going to go first then. Yeah. Hey, listen. We're scaring nobody. <laughs> oh. <laughs> My first is in once. 
thought we could tell. I put a spell on you. Because you're mad. Oh, close that. I'll be in there, what's your pots? It's like Halloween, Claire. What? You look like it's Halloween. It's only May. <laughs> only May? Oh, look, oh. Some, oh no, we've had a burglary. You feel safe because nobody wants to burgle us because I'm in here. <laughs> and there's no to burgle. So guys, it may be almost June. But it's cold. Oh, we're cold tonight, aren't we? So listen, it's time that we put this on. Ready? And listen to the amazing words. Start, Start to work. <laughs> <laughs> I've never known anybody fidget as much. I'm not comfy yet, that's why. I'm not comfy yet. <laughs> When I get comfy, I'll start finishing, okay? I'm pleased that you didn't want to sit outside. didn't we? Yeah. Definitely got robbed. £58 to sit on a premium pitch that is absolutely not level. It's not private. They're having a laugh. There's a main path behind where you walk your dogs <laughs> out into the fields. You can even see, like, I know that you need um, like blocks to level your, your van up and stuff like that, but that's more for like uneven ground, I should have thought. If you're paying £58, it should at least be flat. And we haven't had a problem before, have we? No. But it's here, premium. I'd expect premium plots to be on flat. Yeah, but I can see just looking here how just uneven it really is. Mm. So I think all they've done is just a massive money grab. They've created something that it could be all right when these edges grow, but the edges haven't grown. So they're trying to sell it for something that, that we haven't ready. got. They're not ready for we it. We could yet. stay in a Premier Inn. If you wait up, we pay for us membership fees. We pay for tonight, but we've brought his own van, we've got his own insurance on there, his own bed, his own bedding. Yeah. It's a joke. Our own barbecue. <laughs> yeah. So uh, you didn't, you're not impressed with that barbecue situation. It's very, it's upset me quite a bit. That Although barbecue. it did say it's disposable barbecue. I don't think I read that properly. However, let's think about the positives. Sun shining. It's a big, it's a big, well kept site. It looks really impressive. Mm. You know, if you did like a, an aerial view of this site, it'd look really good. In the town, there are some pubs down there. There's, There's a spa. Two. There's two pubs. One closes. At, the food stops at three, mm. and the food stops at six. And the other one, but they were very rude, <laughs> and we wouldn't eat there if we were starving. <laughs> And if you think you're near Scarborough, you're not. No, I'm near Scarborough. <laughs> it's about, how far? Five miles? It's five miles to Scarborough, it's a mile and a half to the park and ride. So, yeah. We probably wouldn't come back to this site, would we? No. Just simply for the fact that it's not good value. It's too far away. I mean, we know it's like nearly June, we know it's half term, so things are more expensive, but £58 for a picnic bench that I can get in it's a pub. Clean. It's got a bird pool over it. Yeah. I know, well the thing is, they can't really do anything about that, actually, near trees, you but... you think that 50-pound would wipe it down before you got here? They might have done. That's not clean, that, look, that's not new. But there's been noise all morning mm. from people walking down here, which is fine. So you're all on a campsite, but you'd premium. think of a better spot. Should be a bit more out of the way, this, shouldn't it? Yeah. So do you feel like you're being robbed? Yeah. Robbed. Tell you what, though, what I absolutely love the new cheddars. Yeah, I love them. But the morning. Oh, yeah. The morning time's the best. Yeah, absolutely. So we're going to, yeah, we're going to pack down, we're going to finish those drinks, we're going to go down into Scarborough and see what's happening there. One last morn that I'm going to have 
is that there's something around here that's really spiky. So when you go and take your awning down or put it up, it really stings in your hands. It's not just me. It happened to Pablo, you were yelping. So it's not like the best thing to have. So if you're gonna come here with your dog or you got an awning to put up, if you're up in one of these, you might want some gloves. That's me done with morning now, for now. Can't do it, so. Well, you can. I can't, I'm not prepared to force it. All right, so if you have a look there, yeah, there's a handle. There's a handle. Yeah. So you push it forward. Yeah. And then push the seat forward. Yeah, well, I just tried that. I will force no, it. No, just, it just opens. You don't have to force it. Just steady on. Okay. Like that. That's it. That's backwards, not forwards. Mm -hmm. 